Hi everybody, in this video we're going to talk about how to zip and unzip folders and the stuff inside of them. Um, this is extremely important to know how to do because a lot of stuff that you'll download off the internet is is zipped up and there will be times when you'll need to send stuff to people and it's easier if you zip it. Now what zipped means is, let's just talk about that for a second. We, here we've got our folder, our practice folder, and we've got some stuff in it. Now, if you were going to, say you wanted to email this to somebody, you would have to do five separate attachments, and it would have to basically send, take five different, not not five different emails, but you'd, have, you'd be sending five different files. But if you zipped it, you'd only be sending one big file, and it goes a lot easier that way. Um, and also, when you download stuff off the Internet, a lot of times programs, they come zipped, and you have to... Uh, unzip them to, to make them useful. So what the way it works is let's just go ahead and look again. We've got our five different folders or five different files in there. So let's just click it once to select it and then right click, go down to send to compressed folder. And you'll see there Okay, now now down here it's made a new folder, and let's just call this. We'll just leave it practice, but let's just call it add the zip so we know. All right, I'll bring this up here. Now what you need to know is that these two folders are identical. They have the exact same stuff in them, but except that this is really in essence one big file, and this is. Really, it's six files because it's got the folder plus the five uh, plus the five files inside. So now, um, the way that you use a zip file, let's say you've downloaded this off the internet or somebody has emailed it to you. What you do is you double click it, and you can click it again and see what's inside it. Okay, and then go back. And then what you do is you go up here to where it says extract all files. This is what you want to do. And then what you might want to do is just call it just to keep things straight, but you don't even have to do that. And then just click extract. And it will now it's unzipping it. This is what that amounts to. And we can close all of this stuff now. Close it, close it. And you'll see it's appeared down here. I'm going to drag it up. And this is our practice folder. Unzipped, all right? So that's how it works. If you have any questions or anything, if you need any help, let me know. Um, this is very easy to practice. You can't really break anything. And um, that's about it.